It was apparent early in his life that Matteo possessed a deeply spiritual side. He would recite the rosary every day, read the gospel, and he developed a devotion to St. Padre Pio and St. Francis of Assisi. Matteo's cancer first surfaced when he was 13 years old. He smiled at everyone, and even when recovering from surgeries, he tried to cheer up other patients. Doctors believed that the cancer was in remission. But at the end of 2007, his condition grew worse. He underwent another operation, but his arms and legs were paralyzed. Doctors could do no more, and he died soon after that. Matthew's reputation for personal holiness had been witnessed by many.